Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do the daily vibes for around the 26th, but you know the timing is fluid, so uh, whenever it resonates, let's just see what comes up. What do we have for a message today? Jeez, right off the bat, I see judgment. So judgment is truths being revealed, karma being held accountable, responsibility being assigned, uh, acceptance, absolution. Uh, making a judgment call. There could be a resolution. There could be a profound life change or a decision. A big, big decision is being made. There could be release. There could be reconciliation. Um, judgment can mean all kinds of things. I see judgment right off the bat. So judgment, making a judgment call. Um, acceptance and absolution. A wake-up call. Are you ready to be judged? Are you ready to be judged? You ready to tell the truth? Speak the truth. Five of Pentacles reversed. Two of Pentacles. Two of Cups, Five of Swords. Somebody's been pushed away. Five, five, two, two. We have a five and a five and a two and a two. So five, two, two, five. Um, there's a choice, choice, a choice, a choice. Somebody's going to be making a choice. They're going to be making a choice between two. Um, there's been some sort of abandonment. There's been some sort of ghosting of some sort. There's been a decision that's needed to be made. There's. It's been a struggle. It's been a big struggle. Um... It's been a it's been a um, serious battle. I mean, there's five of swords, a hostile situation. We have an individual right here that is upset. He has pushed somebody away, but this individual is looking at a union, and they're thinking about taking a step. Now, this is a player. This is somebody who plays games that is uh, juggling, juggling life, juggling everything. Um, goes back and forth, has a hard time probably making decisions. A fives are about major life choices and twos are about choices as well. So somebody is in the process of making a choice, okay? And it is a big one. Um, they, This person looks pretty upset. Looks pretty, well, it's kind of smug but upset. I see upset in this individual's face. Uh, so this individual is upset, but they have won. These people don't even want to deal with them anymore. So I think something, you know, has come out. Maybe some words have been said or obviously something has happened, which now this individual has lost respect. Nobody respects this person anymore. Um, this person is looking at a union or looking at a partnership. Um, and they may be very upset. Maybe that's their next target. Because this person targets people. Um, five of Pentacles reverse. Now, this is hardship. There could be some sort of financial hardship or total ruin. Okay. Um, this is like an unhealthy relationship. Somebody may be feeling disgraced. They're feel they're in a period of disgrace. They're embarrassed. They're embarrassed. They they're losing respect. They're losing respect. They may have uh, degraded or belittled a partner. Maybe it's a previous partner. Um, I'm not sure. There's definitely some sort of... Uh, well, this person has a really big ego and likes to win at all costs. And it feels like they're disgraced now. And they're really going back and forth as to, you know, what their next move should be. Uh... Hmm. Definitely has to do with a partnership because twos are partnership and fives are power struggle. So somebody is struggling over, you know, what what they should do next. They probably have to let something go because they can't keep playing this game. This is too much. Um, so somebody has to make a choice between two for sure. Um, I do believe there's going to be a turning point here. Let's see what we got. Sun. Interesting. Um, King of Cups reverse. Could be dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Could be dealing with a Leo. Um, 
hard to deal with, hard to work with. We have an individual that doesn't work well with others. Um, does not take orders, doesn't listen to anybody's advice, doesn't respect other people. And there's a lack of respect for other people. Uh, emotionally unavailable, withdrawn, um, not very kind, not very loving. Um, doesn't have good intentions. The King of Cups in reverse is an individual that does not have good intentions. That is not emotionally available. Doesn't work well with others. No togetherness. Lacks respect. Doesn't communicate well. So there is a union here. A partnership that is struggling. Okay, we have a union or a partnership that is struggling. This person over here has pushed people away before. This is an individual who likes to win at all costs. They do not work well with other people. This individual is really, really struggling to uh, gain respect. And I, I think this person who, who wants to gain respect is losing respect. Is you, nobody wants to work with this person anymore. It's like people don't even want to go near this person anymore because they're starting to see who this person is. Um... This two of pentacles is balance, trying to find balance, to be happy. Now, this is extreme happiness. This is healing. This is a breakthrough, and this is a turning point. I said turning point, and then I said there's going to be a turning point, and then the sun came out. This is a breakthrough. This is a new beginning. It's a new day. Uh, it's all about your choices. It's what you choose to invest in. It's what you choose to hang on to. So somebody is in the process of making a choice. Do they want to win or do they want to be happy? There is an opportunity for a union here if this person can communicate and open their heart and go after happiness. But there's some element of needing to prove, you know, to be the winner, okay, to be the winner at all costs. And this is egotistical. So if somebody could let go of their ego, you know, that's the ultimate win here. So, but this person doesn't know that because they just don't, they're not very awakened or whatnot. They're, they're, this person is troubled. Okay. They need to win at all costs. Therefore they push everybody away that comes near them because of their ego. But anyway, uh, this now people don't want to work with, they don't want to work with this person. So this person is losing friends or losing, um, support okay losing some support because people can see people can see the anger you know i could see the anger on this person's face i could see the see who this person with is remember when i picked it up and i looked at it it looks like this person kind of has a, it's meant to look like this person has a smile on their face but it's not a smile it's very it's not you can see right through it you can see right through that this person is not who who their face you can see through the fake smile you know what I mean? It's this person is angry that everybody can see it. So that's what's going on here. Um, this person is angry over a partnership. They're angry over a partnership that they pushed away. You know, um, anyhow, they haven't healed. But anyway, this is a chance to heal because judgment is a, could be a reconciliation or a chance, absolution, a profound change, right? Acceptance. Um, Truth, honesty, karma. Judgment is a card of karma. I know ju I saw judgment, but this is sun. So this is a new beginning. It's a new day. So, Hierophant. So, the Hierophant is a godly energy. It's a higher power. That's guidance. There's some sort of guidance here. Somebody, and this is a guiding light. Guiding light. Okay, so there is a guiding light that is guiding somebody to... Uh, Let go of the victim mentality. Guiding somebody to happiness. They're being guided. Somebody is being guided. And they're also being guided to listen to their intuition. It's a very... This is positive. Okay, this is this is like the Leo season energy. It's very positive. It's, it's, it's a time of growth. So this is uh, faith, believing in oneself, 
Six of Swords reversed. Now that is reluctant to take a new approach, refusing to take a new approach, be staying in a victim mentality. We have somebody here, because that Five of Pentacles is victim mentality. This is refusing. So we have somebody here. This is trouble. That is very trouble. They're refusing to take a new approach. But this is healing. There's an opportunity for a new beginning here. If somebody could take a new approach and believe and have faith. Have, this is a new beginning. Have faith in new beginnings. Faith in new beginnings. Okay? They're being guided to think positive. They're being guided to step out of their fear. They're being guided. Okay? They're being guided to let go of that victim mentality. They're being guided to drop what doesn't serve them. They're being guided to make the choice that their heart wants. This person, somebody isn't following their heart. We have an individual that isn't following their heart with the King of Cups reversed. They're, they're, they're following their ego. Okay? Their ego is driving. Okay? They want a partnership. They have their eye on a partnership. That's what they want, but they can't get it because this person doesn't want to work with them because they're so egotistical. And other people don't want to work with them anymore either because it shows. Anyhow, um, so anyway, what do we got? We have a new beginning here for one with the sun card. This is a, this is a bright new day. This is a breakthrough. It's a turning point. Um, having faith in believing in new beginnings but this king of cups reverse is somebody that doesn't express emotion now this is juggling responsibilities uh trying to needing to find balance between uh other aspects of life and a relationship as well. We have a relationship that is struggling because of responsibilities. Anyhow, this is a union. There is a union here where somebody is uh, feeling betrayed or they have been betrayed and there may have been even been a third party with this three of pentacles and there's embarrassment here there is absolutely embarrassment somebody is very very disgraced they're embarrassed they're embarrassed but there's an opportunity to heal there's if you would just listen to your gut and follow your heart there's an opportunity to heal This two of pentacles is a change of some sort. That is a change. A change of heart. A, there is a change of heart here. Somebody is being guided to follow their heart. And their heart will lead them right into a union. But they have to let something go first. You can't have both. That's what this is. You have to let something go. So anyway, what the hell is going on? Um, somebody is being receiving messages, messages from above because the sun is up there and this is messages. Somebody is receiving guidance from above. And the messages that they are receiving is saying, let that go. Open your heart. Nine of Pentacles reverse. Now this is insecurity. We have somebody here that is very, very insecure. They just don't want to be alone. Somebody is in a partnership that they don't want to be in just because they don't want to be alone. <laughs> and there is an opportunity for love here. There is. You know, we could have somebody that, and you know how I said judgment is karma. We could also have a, say, for example, this just came to me. We could have a business owner that is losing it all. Because this is total ruin and this could be, lo they're losing their business. Their business is going downhill. 
Three of Pentacles, Nine of Pentacles reversed, and the Five of Pentacles. Somebody's, you know, business is going downhill fast. And it's because of their arrogance. Nobody wants to work with them anymore. People can see through the mask. Anyhow, uh, the Two of Cups, there is an opportunity for a union here. But you have to do the right thing. Judgment is about making a judgment call. It's about acting with integrity. It's about doing the right thing. Judgment is a card of forgiveness as well. But the ego is in the way because this is very much ego. Ego is in the way of a happy union. Somebody's ego is getting in the way of a true love connection. So we have me for somebody else. I don't know who, but we also have an independent person that is all alone. That is probably about to get into a commitment. Okay, because this is a commitment. This is a new beginning. A happy new beginning. Uh, a commitment leads to marriage, independence, to commitment. We could also have a commitment that's going to independence. Okay? This is a new day. Okay? And judgment is a judgment call. It's a release. It's an absolution. It's an acceptance. It's the end of things. It's truths being revealed. So be prepared for some truths to be revealed. Somebody hasn't been following their heart. But I think we're about to have a breakthrough. Because they are being guided. Because sun is heart. They are being guided to follow their heart. And so they're going to. They're going to be releasing something. A burden, something that's been holding them down. So this is this is like dropping weight, dropping baggage, letting it go. Somebody is gonna let go of their need to prove and drop something that is holding them back from happiness. So that's what's gonna happen. I think it's there's there there could be um because of this card right here somebody that walks away from an individual that was pretending this person cuz I feel a big pretending here this person was pretending that they cared and they realize it so the other person the third party or whatever walks away and then this part, this person's been looking at another partnership the whole time. Anyhow, um, judgment is the end. There's going to be a change. A change of partners. Good luck.